Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Let's Play Academia School Simulator. My name is Weasel, and today we're, we're gonna build something uh, that the school was lacking, lockers. They weren't really showing under any of these tabs, but they're in the all section, so I will actually build a few of those, even though we're a little low on money. Uh, quite a bit low on money, as a matter of fact. Um, let's pull them over on this side, just the hallway along the hallway. That's where you put them, right? That's where lockers belong, over here. I, I, I hope I'm right. It'll be fine, I'm certain. We're gonna see them hopefully use it. Uh, other than that, this is all freshmen, but we're not getting any more freshmen. Which is a problem. So how do I get these guys to join us? It might have something to do with the day, uh, the, the time of year. Maybe they only join once a year. That would be my best bet. Anyway, I want to fire both these teachers to save a little bit of money so we're not immediately done for. Also dismantling a little bit on this side. We don't need that many items. It's going to save us some money. And my to-do is currently empty because I have not set up any grant. How about we do Expanding Horizons to build a library and a computer lab? That sounds great. I would also like uh, to build a fountain. Uh, potted plant. Nope, nope, not looking for that. There was like a drinking fountain somewhere. Food counter, fax, file cabinet. Right, offices. We don't have those yet. Oh, and windows. They were. That's in some light, but also encourages daydreaming. You know what? Let's uh, <laughs> let's add some windows to these rooms. I think that's not a bad idea. It's been a little uh, gloomy in here. Good enough, and some in here. It's not too expensive, but I think uh, windows are a great thing to have in a school. Okay, water fountain. Let's see if I use it. I put one in this corner and I'm gonna put one like this. Yep, they are definitely using their lockers. Well, they could be best better. What does it say? F and B. Cleanliness is at a B. Uh, that's at least something. Wait. Oh, it's not indoors anymore. I wanted to demolish, not the wall, but one of these items. My bad. Let's, uh, that sink. That sink though, dismantle that. Thank you. Let's build a concrete wall. Yeah, that's not a good toilet if there's part of the wall missing. They told me. Ah, okay, the arrival is in two days. That's how this goes. Basically, you're saying, oh, I want these many more people. That's good to know. Let's turn this off for now. Let's see, uh, we have room for 20 more freshmen, I, I would say. Oh, actually more, 40 more freshmen. Now it's just about surviving for two days. Oh, look at them, they're all eating. I guess the food was prepared. That seems to work now. Yeah, go go and wash it. Excellent choice. I mean, hopefully somebody washes it soon. There you go. Excellent. Things are working out slowly but steadily. Wait, anyway, who's the who's that guy? No clue. Benches. Oh my. Bulletin board. A place to post stuff. Yeah, sure. Uh, we'll put the bulletin board on the wall like this. Bookshelves. Are they going to go into the classrooms? I see no reason why not. Maybe it makes people smarter, just having books around. At least they will seem smarter, no matter if they are or not. A clock is also a thing we should put in these rooms of ours. So the students can stare at it all day long like I did. Okay, computer lab, minimum size 7x5. Oh boy, that's, that's a big one. Ah, no! Next day. Totally missed that. Excellent, 7x5. Eventually, we'll have a small room in there, too. But for now, we'll be fine. Oh no, one of them is <laughs> One of them got locked in, you idiot. Also, what about the office? We haven't really used that yet. Also, just realizing there isn't really an office uh, zone. Fairly odd. Anyway, computer lab needs five chairs and five computers. Easy peasy. One, two, one in the middle, and then two over here and five chairs. Who's teaching that? Or is is anyone even teaching that? Maybe it's really just a computer room for students to play some LAN games. That would be cool to have. All right, we're at minus 1,000 probably because of the electricity. Yeah, I'm not, not surprised. And wonderful. Time to put some concrete tiles down. Your funds are running low. Oh yeah, they are. They definitely are. Um, if I build a library, I will get 5,000 for completion. But I don't have that yet. 
Oh, guys, we're gonna go broke. We're gonna go broke. How are we gonna save enough money? Firing nurses, janitors, and cooks and workers. Well, arrival tomorrow, so that would be my hope that all of these kids arrive tomorrow and then we're okay. How big does a library need to be? Minimum size 5x5. Five five. Damn you! I don't have that room! Okay, 5x5. Five five. Let's see. Concrete wall is 100. Blue wall is only 10. Oh, brick wall is only 10. I have no idea why concrete walls are so expensive. Well, brick wall it is. Library also needs a bookshelf and three chairs and a table. Okay, the bookshelf is going to cost us 100. Sweet! We now have them all over in these rooms. Guess they're useless there. That's where we're going to dismantle them. Hopefully make some money back. Hopefully. Oh, did you, did you guys just pee in the faculty room? <sighs> Looks like it. Great. Great job. Right, we're also going to need a chair and three tables. Other way around. A table and three chairs? Okay, that should make us some money. I know my funds are running low. Wonderful. Expanding Horizons completed gives us 5,000 bucks. And now we can replace this with concrete walls to make it look more uniform. Yeah, I guess this is how you save some money. If you ever need to save some. Okay, let's have a look. Why is everyone so upset? Are you learning art, science? Oh, look at that subject. They're all pretty good. I'm fairly surprised. We're gonna need a better science and physical education teacher, I guess. Is that your fault, Barrett? Is that your fault? It might be. What about Tiffany's? 500 a day, but she's really, really good. I could hire her, but it's like 6,000 signing bonus. That, that cost me a lot of money when I kicked the other two out. I basically lost all that money. Anyway, what about a fan? Cools down a room. I didn't know that that was necessary. I, I won't do it. All right, now we're gonna apply for the school expansion to get 50 people in here, or 50 kids, which we hopefully will get tomorrow. It says uh, arriving tomorrow. Six, more than 6,000 a day. That's gonna be interesting to see how my school can handle this. I'm already fairly certain we're gonna need another canteen table and bench. All right, 60 transferee students are coming. Let's see <laughs> how accurate this. Today, woo, 20 sophomore, 40 more freshmen. We're gonna be so, we're gonna be overflowing. Yay, completed. Look at all the students. It's a rush. Very nice, so in four days we could get more. Now that we completed that, we got 2,500 extra and school expansion 75. Well then. You know what that means. Oh god, look at this club. <laughs> I think we need to make this one bigger. Uh, the club room. So far they don't seem to have a problem with it. But I imagine uh, the fire marshal is not going to agree with us on that one. Alright, let's do a blue wall. As opposed to the blue ball. Oh, that's going to be a big one. This is going to be a big one. Which also reminds me we're going to need lockers for all of these folks. Right now, we don't really have any. Okay, more lockers. Yeah, let's just fill up the hallway with them. No harm in that. Oh, damn it. I'm just realizing we have all of these students, but we have no teachers. <laughs> all right, Tiffany. Since we're making a little bit of extra money, we're going to get ourselves a, uh, what is that, doctorate. Bam, you're going to teach them. And who else? Kenyatta Kerst. Sure, a doctorate also for the freshmen here. And... Osvaldo Vitum. Yeah, just, just the best. Oh, day's over? Your school ran out of money and had to be closed down. Oh, no! While I hired people, I... That's, um... <laughs> well, I might as well load the last autosave. <laughs> My bad. My bad. I was not aware that uh, this could happen. Uh, we can't afford the higher uh, the signing bonus. That is what actually costs the most money. So if you get like a doctorate, it's like four thousand or six thousand. Right. So we signed him. How about no doctorate, just masters maybe? Can maybe afford that? All right, freshman. And we're gonna need a third teacher. How much do I have? I have nine thousand two hundred. Sure. Doctorate. Screw it. It's fine. Wait. Who who doesn't? Who's not assigned? to a room yet. Quick look. Zone edit. The freshman one has one. This freshman has one. I think the sophomore doesn't have one. Okay, no problem. Hire another teacher for the sophomore. Tiffany. Alright, we have... How much do we have left? 
Supposedly 9,000. I feel that's a lie. Maybe it's not. Oh, right, we, 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 we finished that expansion, that add-on. Meaning now I can do this. All right, turns out I ran into another bug that required me to restart the game. I was not seeing uh, any items I selected or I couldn't place them down for whatever reason, but just quitting the game and reloading that safe did the trick. This is definitely an early access title with quite a few bugs that need to be squashed out. But so far it's very, um, it's fun. And I see a lot of potential in this. If the, you know, if they do the same thing that Prison Architect did, which was basically improving it over and over and over again uh, until the game was, uh, as it is today, a very complex title. Um, yeah, so we have 4,800 plus 3,700. We can work with that. Did I hire enough people? Hopefully. Second period. Well, nobody's in here yet. Where is everybody? It says that I have all of these kids, student subsidy, but I don't see anyone in here. They will probably join back in tomorrow. Uh, again, slight, little, little bit buggy. Definitely worth letting this uh, sit for a while uh, until the bugs are squashed. Oh, Eleanor. Yeah, I have teachers, but no students. I still only have the classroom uh, with the freshmen full. So now I'm basically waiting for the next day to see if they actually join back in. Why are the workers peeing in the bushes? You gotta, you really gotta stop this, guys. This is really gross. Let's put some grass on the outer parameter just to make it look a little bit nicer. And how about we put the worker quarter somewhere else over here? Five by five. And we're gonna remove this zone and build it over here. Five by five workers quarters. Enjoy. Maybe we should give them a, a, a room to stay in soon. Okay, we're definitely not running out of lockers anytime soon. And we probably want to expand the club so more peeps fit in. 4,800. Let's put some concrete tiles down. Can barely afford it, but we can't afford it. Oh, 75, so, 74, so close to the next, um, what's it called, school expansion. Just need one more. I guess I can always take one, one more freshman in 150 days. And a fresh new day has started, let's see. This looks like definitely more than before. Look at this big group of Wow, you're just like a trampling horde. That's what you are. So yeah, uh, now is a fresh new day, and we have the people coming in, the the kids spreading out. Yeah, you just hang out in that club room. No, you can't walk that invisible line that I put down. The rest is forbidden. Can I make this? Ah, nah, I can't. Zone edit. Remove zone and add zone. Make this one big. I wish I could just expand it, but it doesn't seem like it wants to do that for me. Wait, where's my teacher for the sophomore class? Oh, I have three teachers. I need a few more. Whoops. Okay, I need someone who's not super expensive. 4,900. Marnell Estrada. Sure, that'll work for me. Go and teach these poor kids. All right, evaluation, passing rate, still an F. Then again, nobody had to pass yet. They seem to be fairly smart. Look at these. Very smart, m smart folks. So far, this doesn't allow me to take too much, um, to make too many changes to like the educational schedule or something like this. I would love to be able to manually change some things up and uh, affect the education more. For now, this is, seems to be mo mostly focusing around the building aspect and just keeping it somewhat running smoothly. Damn. Need more janitors. It's way too filthy in here. And I can't afford anything anymore. Your funds are running low. Yes, you can spend too much and go broke. Should not be a thing. You should not be able to click and make yourself broke. It should, you know, just not let you build something at that point. You're out of money. You have to wait. Anyway, guys, I think I'm pretty happy with my first impression here that I got this little short series of uh, the game. If you're not too keen on dealing with those bugs and uh, any upcoming bugs in the future, I would probably let this sit a while and wait for uh, more features to be added and more bugs to be squashed. In any case, thanks so much for watching. I'm Weasel, I'm out, and I hope to see you around. Bye-bye.